Hi, I'm Bob Rubart with the Oracle Technology Network, and I'm here in the OTN Lounge at Open World 2014 with another two-minute tech tip. Hi, I'm Kevin McGinley with uh, Red Pill Analytics. I'm the uh, owner and co-founder, and we do Oracle BI services. So I'm going to talk to users about how to use the direct database requests feature in OBIE to empower their super users with the ability to query databases directly bypassing the OBIE metadata layer. Your two minutes starts now. Excellent. Okay, so if you're a user of Oracle Discover or Interactive Reporting, also called IR, one of the things that you've found recently is that it's time to move to OBIE. As Discover and Interactive Reporting are not on the strategic roadmap for Oracle's business intelligence products. Now, when Discover and IR users start looking at OBIE, one of the things they get a little bit frustrated with is the enterprise metadata layer, which is actually one of the strengths of the tool. However, users of Discover and interactive reporting are not used to using a metadata layer. They are used to having direct access to the database. Fortunately, there is a feature in OBIE that's not used as much for the folks who focus on the enterprise metadata layer, and it's called the direct database request. You can enable this feature for certain users within your organization, and once you do that and provide them with the name of a connection pool to a database, they can write their own SQL, paste it into the answers interface that's part of OBIEE, and return the results of that query and start using the interactive components and the views of an analysis to build something just like they would do against the metadata layer. Now, you're going to want to do a couple things when enabling this feature. First, you're going to want to set dedicated connection pools for these users and secure them so that only they can use them. Second, there's some um, web admin features that you have to turn on to enable this, user, this feature for end users. And then lastly, you're going to want to basically turn off some features within the analysis interface because those features are not supported with the direct database request. So if you're migrating from interactive reporting or discover, you can use the direct database request to please your end users who love to write SQL and just want to query the database directly. Excellent job.